Good evening, guys. Yeah, things are looking a lot different here at BWI Marshall these days. Taking a look at the Southwest Terminal here, for example, uh, we're seeing a lot more traffic pass through here. Some of the largest passenger numbers we've seen since the pandemic has begun. And with all of this growth, they are adding things here at the airport as well. Today, they unveiled some new construction that was done on one of their busiest gate areas. With mask restrictions being lifted around the country, there is new life at BWI Marshall. According to airport officials, on May 13th, more than 24,000 outbound passengers passed through, the most since March of 2020. And the week of May 9th saw more than 141,000 passengers processed, also the most since March of 2020. Numbers are up across the board, domestic, international, you name it, people, people are traveling. Travel advisor Dilworth Daly, who has given us the pulse of the travel industry since the pandemic began, says thanks to COVID restrictions being lifted, more and more people are anxious to vacation again. Puerto Rico and the U.S. Virgin Islands and also the state of Hawaii. My bookends for those areas have definitely gone up. Out of BWI Marshall Monday, more signs passenger numbers are going up. A ribbon cutting of the A-Gates expansion project with new restaurants, concessions, and state-of-the-art bathrooms. Just imagine, a year ago, we were down 96% of our traffic, and we're now hovering around 35 to 38% down. Executive Director Ricky Smith, along with Governor Hogan, officially opened the area. The public and privately funded project took about three and a half years to complete. Smith told reporters it was good to see the terminal busy with people once again. It was an eerie feeling to, to have a terminal of this significance, this size, um, so underutilized. And so it's certainly a sign um, that we're recovering, that the marketplace is coming back. People are flying primarily for leisure purposes, um, which is good.